Welcome to a rising world with the plugin called Simple Cars. All this does is allow you to spawn in two cars currently, being the Lexus and the Police Ford car. Right now I spawned in the Lexus, so I was testing it, driving it, which is quite simple actually, but it's nice that you can bring this in. And that you can interact with it, as you can see, just press F to enter. And then you can drive around by pressing W. A to rotate, you can't do it at the same time. S, D, W, A, and you get the point. And as you can see, you can still press F to exit the car, press F to enter, and it's really touchy because it's brand new, but you can also break it. To spawn it back in, you can also type car help. To get the list, which is simple, car type, you just type in the either Lexus or it was either police. You can get car help, which basically gives you this list. And then the car type, the position and everything. You can even put on the various axis, height, rotate it, whichever I guess. So for here, I'll do car help again. Car type, I guess. I forgot how I got that list, but here it is, car list, that's, that's what it is. So it's Lexus and police, so I'll spawn in car Lexus. And you can see it just spawned right next to me. It pushed me out of the way though. And for here, I'll do car police. There you go, with funky wheels. Yeah, this is still brand new, so give it some time when we actually get vehicles too I haven't tried this one out so press F oh that's funky pressing F2 let's see if that helps it does oh shit that's quicker than the Lexus and it doesn't adjust to height and terrain so this is what you get Wow, where am I? There it is. Good thing I've got that tower there. This is way too quick. The police car is the way to go, and I can see people abusing it instead of using a uh, normal holding shift to run, I guess. As you can see, rotation speed is 360 to catch the Lexus. The speed is 50. So let's compare with this. It's... 5.0 and the rotation speed is 90 this is how fast this goes and as you can see it's gonna give you weird clippings or no yeah it doesn't adjust to terrain which it should and there are plans as to let's see here to add physics administrability for the admins admin uh, well I can't pronounce that why Administrability to add fuel to make it run, multi key. Right now you can only hold W, A, and it, you can't do W and A. Then you could. You should fly if you enter a car because as character gets repelled from the ground, you notice that right now. Yep, he doesn't know how to do this without pressing F2. Let's press F. Now I'm flying everywhere. Oh shit lucky so let's try this again F and you notice I'm up here without F2 Ooh. okay how's it gonna be on water nope but as you can see oh shh what the yeah it's very touchy wow oh wow that's out oh, shit 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 Holy crap, I don't want to lose my inventory right now. And a sheep's pushing me. Wow. Okay, let's just get back home. Yeah, this is the potential Rising World has to add vehicles. And this is just in the plugin API form right now. Let's get out. I said get out. F. 
Yeah, you can basically label things as furniture, cars, and all that in the document files. And right now, I guess it's something like movement. That you can get label things furniture as all in one model, give textures to it. You can bring in dogs, anything you think of, things from fandoms and all that. And one thing I must clarify is that you must do it in chat, not this uh, command this command bar up here, it has to be in chat, slash chat, or I mean car, and then Lexus. It won't work up here, here I'll show you. Our Lexus, nope, not found. And to get rid of this, just simply hit it, again, and again. Now can you imagine Rising World with actual cars and vehicles? I can, thanks to this. So let's once again add car Lexus. And let's take it for a spin and I'll show you once again how clipping works. This barricade here just goes right through. It doesn't even handle these blocks so make sure you spawn on, on top of it or something. And there's my glitchy friggin things over there. Cotton. If you watched the last episode you'll know what I'm talking about. Okay let's break this. You can't destroy if somebody is still driving. If somebody tried to destroy your car. Oh, that's nice. It has protection. Press F. Break it. Okay, let's see what happens with the jumping jitteriness if I put on here. Slash car Lexus. Oh, see what I mean? Car Lexus. There, it's much smoother. You had to... Make sure the ground is even. But what would be nice is speeding this thing up a little bit, just by enough. Excuse me. And you would have to make sure your pathways are straight as an arrow. It can't deviate in any form. Wow, this thing's touchy. So yeah, I can't wait for physics, fuel, multi-keys, and all that stuff. This is almost like Movecraft for Minecraft, but much better. It handles much better. You don't have to press left or right button, mouse button. So let's get back here. Let's try the... Actually, let's just... Yeah, police car. Slash car police. Oh, wow. This thing is way too quick. So slow down. Damn it. Okay, I think I'll just stand it there. Okay, that's a new error. Okay, where am I? Safety first. Wow. Come on. So yeah, that's the simple cars. As simple as it gets, really. That I had to really draw it out in stupid manner. You can also jump on it. It's actually a solid item. And very glitchy. So thanks for watching and see you next time. Okay, so if you're wondering how to install the Simple Cars plugin, just go to the main thread I linked below in the description as well as linked in the annotation right on the right wheel here, annotation. Then place it here, rising world slash plugin slash simple cars. It should look like this. Look in the chat bar there. That's how it should look. And I'll do a little text below, just so you know where. And then you can drive around these things, but be cautious. They're buggy as hell, as you noticed. So, safe driving, and happy Rising World Gaming. See you next time.